Good evening to you, friends. I'm Greg Merriweather. My partner Liz has the night off. A weekend filled with parades kicked off tonight with the crew of Artemis, the only female crew, the first and only. They just wrapped up 21 years of parades. Hard to believe. Here's a live look uh, on the right hand side of our uh, tower cam as they made their way through, showing the streets much love. Dion Guillory brings us all the sights and sounds to kind of kick off Mardi Gras here in Baton Rouge. The crew of Artemis rolled right on time at 7 o'clock on this beautiful Friday night. They rolled down here, lighting up downtown, not only with their floats, but also their throws. And with those sounds, you know it's carnival season. The crew of Artemis didn't disappoint. So this is actually my favorite, my family's favorite parade. We come every year. We've came every year since I was a little girl. So this is something that I'm really excited to pass on to my little cousins and my future family. Mm -hmm. uh, beads and hanging out with my friends. Mm -hmm. And there were plenty of beads. This year's theme is Artemis tunes into TV with floats having TV or movie themes to the family friendly Finding Nemo or scary good young Frankenstein, but not as scary as this guy wearing a ghost face mask. It's Mardi Gras, but you have on a traditional Halloween costume. What, what, what's the thought behind this? Let's just bring some fun out. Why not? Why has it got to be specific now? Let's let's tie it all in because it's all the crazy people out here, right? Right. Crazy about throws and of course making sure your dance moves are golden no matter your age. I like that we can get candy and beats. Is that what you're excited about? Mm -hmm. A sweet way to kick off a weekend full of parades. And everybody I talked to out here said it's all about the fun and they're excited to do it for the rest of carnival season. In downtown Baton Rouge, Dion Guillory, WAFB 9 News.